Hey there, this is Bill Schulteis. I'm the creator of The Coffee House Investor. Together we're helping each other build wealth, ignore Wall Street, and get on with our lives. And if there ever was a time for us to help each other, work together, get on with our lives, now's the time. Today's the day. With what's going on around the world, this coronavirus pandemic continues to be front and center from a health perspective. In the United States, we're dealing with the national election that is in front of us, and it's certainly going to be very divisive and acrimonious. And we need to work together. We need to up our game so that we, with our families, our communities, our careers, we are working in harmony to make this world a better place. And there's three things that I'm doing to keep my spirits up over the next three to six months and beyond. And the first thing that I'm doing is I'm making an extra special effort to play. And that's so important. You know, play is sometimes can seem a little frivolous when we've got so much to do, but play is essential to our emotional health. I'm reading a great book called Play, How It Shapes the Brain, Opens the Imagination, and Invigorates the Soul. I've listed that book on my uh, newsletter, and in it, the authors talk about the importance of finding time to play. They say the opposite of play is not work, the opposite of play is depression. And I know when I don't take time to play, whether it's playing golf or reading a book and really committing my mental energy to that, I get a little down. So I invite you to look at how you can accentuate play in your own life. The second thing that I'm doing, and I've done this for a long time, but I'm upping my game in that, is I'm taking more time and making more of an effort to show gratitude for things that I'm grateful for. I keep a journal called the Self Journal, and in the morning it invites me to list three things that I'm grateful for. In the evening it invites me to list three things that I'm grateful for. But I'm even making an extra special effort in my life to look for opportunities to express gratitude for whoever I run into or ever, whatever experience I have. I invite you to do the same. The third thing that I am doing is I am continuing to track my spending. And again, that may sound a little trite, but the more that I can create harmony with the way that money flows through my life, the better off I'm going to be emotionally and financially. And it all st starts with keeping track of how we spend our money. Now, we all have different ways for keeping track of how we spend our money. I happen to keep track of it on an Excel spreadsheet. And once you've got a system down, it's a piece of cake. But it really allows me the confidence to know that I'm on track with my financial goals. And it starts with keeping track of how much I'm spending. So keep those three things in mind. One more thing, there is always a debate about whether or not you should dollar cost average or lump sum a chunk of money into the stock market. Well, I'm listing, I've listed a free report published by Dimensional Fund Advisors DFA. You can get that free report on my website. You can click below this video and I think you would find it a very interesting read. So take a moment. Like this video, subscribe to my YouTube channel. There's more information at coffeehouseinvestor.com. This is Bill Schulteis. I'll catch you next week.